Hi, welcome to Shaha Computer. In this video, we will introduce a new Google Sheet template where you can create the monthly duty roster for your employees very quickly and automatically. The main USP of this automatic duty roster is even if different employees has different types of shift rotation style, then also you can create the duty roster for all the employees in a single template very easily within a few seconds. So let's see how this template works and can reduce your workload. So this is the Google Sheet template we are talking about. Basically, we have two worksheets in this template. First one is setting sheet and the second one is master sheet. So with the help of this master sheet, we can create multiple number of duty roster for different months. We'll understand this step by step. So first we'll discuss the setting sheet and after that we'll understand the master sheet. So let's go to setting sheet. Here, the setting sheet is very simple. We have few list here. First is month list. Here we have created a month list from January to December. You can rearrange the name of this month according to your requirement. Then we have the year list. We have given here from 2021 to 2025. Here you can also delete these years and input the years according to your requirement. Then we have the shift names and the shift legend. Here you can keep up to 10 shift names and here 10 shift legends for each shift names but you have to remember the shift legend should be one letter you cannot use two letter for a shift legend and you cannot use a duplicate shift legend for any shift names after that we have to create the rotation styles so here we have five rotation type shift a b c d and e i have named this in this way but you can change this name according to your requirement then you have to create the rotation style for each shift type here for shift a i have given five morning then two call days then five afternoon then two off then again start from morning shift similarly we have created for shift b c d and e this is all about the setting sheet for now on the right hand side we have the shift data that is we have to create a dependent drop down list for all the employees in the master sheet so we'll discuss this after creating the master sheet so this is all about this setting sheet so now let's move to master sheet so first we will understand all the screen components of master sheet so first here we can see we have a month list from january to december that we have created in the setting sheet then we have the year list 2021 to 2025 and here it is the date from where the month will start this is the start date of the month this is the end date of the month and the total number of days and here you can see we have the date from 1st of january to the last of january whenever we change the year and month all these things are changed these days are also changed let's see if we select here 2024 you can see days are changed because all the dates are also changed here you can see January 2024, 31st January 2024. If I want to start the month from 10th of January, type here 10th, you can see the date is changed from 10th of January 2024 to 9th of February 2024. The total days is 31. If I select here February, you can see the date starts from 10th February 2024 to 9th March 2024 total days is 29 and here last date is 9 so in this way whenever we select any month or date these are changed so we will create the duty roster for me so select here me and we'll start it from first of the month so now you can see is from first may to 31st may then here we have the employee names so here you can enter up to 100 employee names whenever you add a new employee name a new blank cell will appear suppose type here employee 11 you can see new row is created here and these are the shift types that is the employee will fall on which employee type that we have done in setting so there is shift a b c d or e so here we will get the shift type list and here the shift list whenever we select here then we'll get the drop down list here then we have the report for all the shifts for each day that is total morning shift on first total afternoon shift on first day night shift day shift and total day shift then on the right hand side here we can get the total number of shift for each employee so here we'll get the total number of morning shift for the first employee afternoon shift 
night shift off days days and call days all the shift for first employee so now we will start creating the duty roster for month of may so we have already taken 2024 and may now we have to create the complete list of employee for those we want to create the roster so we will not add any new employees here now we will select here the shift type a now here we will get the drop down list click here m1 you can see automatically all the shifts are created similarly if you select this way for all the employees shift c you want to start it from off days shift d you want it from a3 shift e start from c4 in this way you can change all the shift types for the employees and shift start days for the employees now after creating this you have to check your requirement if all the requirement is fulfilled then it's okay otherwise again you can change this way to make the changes as per the requirement here we'll get the total number of shift for each employees morning shift 13 afternoon shift 10 night shift 0 off days 4 days 0 call days 4 so here we have the final report for each employee so after doing the roster you have to save this as a month 2024 but remember after saving the sheet in different sheet you cannot change this so first click here duplicate and rename this as may 2024 that's all you have finally created the digital roster within few seconds so in this way you have to create the digital roster for employees so if you want to learn how to create this template or want to purchase this template the link is given below in the description box you can get it from there if you like this video please hit the like button and share this video with all your friends and colleagues thanks for watching the video till the end see you soon in the next tutorial of this template